And uh, just make sure everything's all set up. We, oh. have, we have the most rigged setup ever. It says Geek Checks is live. I gotta check this out. Oh crap, Cultaholics is live too. How are we, <laughs> <laughs> How are we ever gonna be used? Hey guys, how's it going? Listen up, Rangers. Welcome to the Geek Chest. My name's Steve. My name's Ernest. And today we're going to be doing a live stream commentary and then our review on God Raga versus King Oga. Somebody follow. What will reign? Came Somebody in, help uh, me. 2019, I guess. And, uh, interesting thing. You gotta start it back up because we have to have a timestamp for when people, if they want to watch. It is started from beginning. Don't touch no, shit. You had it 14 seconds into the thing. Why don't you go 14 just... 14 seconds, okay. Most disappointing movie. Ah, I don't know. Have you seen Dragon Wars? <laughs> I haven't watched this yet. Uh, the other one I actually got to see. Oh, the case is already damaged. What did you do? I got hungry. What What's in... Oh, yeah, I don't know either. Shit. <sighs> um, it's a... Turtle horn kaiju? At least from the pictures? Well, I'm trying to be optimistic. The last one was, I think, fine. <laughs> Can we start this nonsense now? Alright, so we're officially starting it now. So if you guys want to keep up while watching this with us, heck yeah, we're eating totally not sponsored Pop Secret. Should, though. This is the only popcorn I had at my house. And since we're watching the movie... I feel like it's only fitting that we she have something. She. Eventually, we will probably do some fun stuff while we're doing this. Because we want to try to do this like once a week-ish. Towards the weekends. Yeah, we'll grab like one of those uh, snack boxes and then, you know, go to town with it. You're 100% correct that Arnez eats DVD cases. It's what he does. That effect looks fine. There's what issue I've seen Oh is my that, god, this is PlayStation 1 graphics. What is this? What problem I've seen is I have a really bad glare from your light right there. <laughs> then you're good. Lord have mercy, this is bad. You just being bombarded by shit. Oh, not the model kit. No, it's fine. Oh. How does it progressively get worse? I'll say the last one wasn't that bad. This is back to being like the first one. That's what Brand, I mean. I think this is scenes from the original, that one. To be fair. Oh, yeah, it's movie going. theater style popcorn. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty spiffy. Oh, there's so many hellos. So for all those people just joined, how's it going? Hello. This looks like something that Looks like he's having a seizure. Now we're back underwater. The King Raigo had no mercy. Yeah, because this is from the first one. The movie that we shall not speak its name. This is worse than the first one. It's the same. It can't be worse. It's the same movie. So far, anyways. The Turn turtle in. farted? Arnold's literally is a critic. He criticizes everything that I do. Yeah, I do. He bought us cheap-ass popcorn. That's not true. There's cheaper. I think I'd rather taste it cheaper than this. At least <laughs> I know it's cheap. That's like, there's a great value. <laughs> At least this is a store-bought, store brand. What's that like, Pop Seeker? I think it's better than Orville Red Box, to be fair. Should have bought the Orville Red Bucket thingy. To be honest, it's better if you just make it yourself. More than likely. From the deep, deep ocean. There's some lightning. I might have to turn this down a little. I don't care. Let me see if it goes through. I don't care. Let me see if it goes through. See, it doesn't go through. I heard splashing. I heard. Under the sea. Oh, another Raiga appears. Oh my oh god, Bill has got 
But this is already better than the last one because the building actually got destroyed, although he just kind of appeared. Aaron, please donate that $20 so I don't have to watch this. For the love of fucking God, That's what nice is fun. this? The suit still looks fine. The suit is fine. There's never been a problem with the suit. Everything else around here sucks. The Defense Force and Taito gave their all in combat. This is so far has just been pretty much previous stuff from the last movie. Hey, The Chosen, how's it going? What Got some jets is this? Shooting, <laughs> shooting at a folk, a folk map. Let's see, like, if the movie was like this the entire time, I think it'd be fine. They awoke in a demon. A demon that pees all over the buildings. At least, the best part from the previous at least I'll get fat. That's true. I'll say the suit's definitely better than Minya. The Minya is better than this movie. Minya in general, probably. Suit. Hi, I'm here. Hey. How's it going? How's it going? Alright, so this is eight years after the last movie. Oh, returning characters. The eye patch dude's in this. Okay, I'm already liking this movie more than I thought I would just because they have returning characters. <laughs> so their office is at the bathroom? I never oh, show mercy. Together. This is actually pretty sweet. They literally just went to an outhouse. Hey, how's it going? Oh, this toilet. I can't show Steve mercy. If I do, then he'll get cal he'll calm down. I'll get overconfident. Yeah. Oh, that sucks about your neck, huh? Oh, there's the other returning character. Hopefully, it's kind of repairable. Because I usually I use like a Dremel with uh, paper clips and glue. He's already in. What do you mean, come in? Well, how can you talk to him if he's behind the door? I told him to come in if you don't see him. Ah, uh, I'm forced here against my will. Uh. What do you mean against your will? You like monster movies. I love monster movies. I don't like trash. And this is trash. We haven't even got that far into it. Can't be critical about it yet. Kaido? Oh, I take it they're talking about the commander. Yeah. He destroyed more of the city than the kaiju did. Hey, Godzilla 2000. Pray to God this popcorn will last me an entire movie, Steve, or otherwise you and this DVD are going to fly through this small window right here on the side. It's only 84 minutes, you got to survive. <laughs> I don't want to. Oh, crap. Can't get that casino open. It just doesn't make sense. That's a little 2000. How's it going? He does have a point. Godzilla's revenge is also a charm. Oh, this guy's charm, though. Oh, I, mean, I don't usually. Doc, feel, I don't really ever feel like watching revenge, but Doc X. Yeah, that that is so true. I mean, I want to watch this door. You know what? I'd rather watch Door to Explore than this. At least I know there's a good ending <laughs> to it. <laughs> that is a pretty good ending. This is Steve wanting to watch a crappy movie, and I drag our does a lot with me. But this is movie theater butter popcorn. It's like we're experiencing going down to our local theater. Kind of wish it was a little saltier, to be fair. You know what we need to watch? 98 Godzilla. Have it? We've done a commentary. Yeah, but it got taken down, remember? Because we didn't do an actual commentary. Oh. 
<laughs> well, we did the review. It did get taken down, but uh, we didn't we did make great money on it. You know, Canon works. That movie's great. You know, Canon works in a movie theater, right? Yeah. We go get free popcorn there. Uh, AMC's like a uh, Fair Day's got the best popcorn around here. I don't know. Why is it all toys? <laughs> it's all toys. <laughs> what the fuck? I it's mean, always where Coyote Station. I know I'm from. But wait, the Prime Minister's new project will take place. In. What? Oh my God! I like that the United States military is toys. United States military guys is I think literally. Anyways, I don't know. It's supposed to be U.S. Army. Back. It's just toys. No, but they're referencing themselves as Jeff. Why is he picking his nose? He's cutting. Did we really need a close-up shot of that? <laughs> I'm bored, just like watching this movie. UK gamer, no, it's not okay. A boredom meets peace. I like that they work in a bathroom and just guns. <laughs> guns everywhere. You can definitely tell the bottom uh, gun right there is a plastic one. This is those old, like, uh, Kmart, you know, Dude, oh, oh, for sure. Dude, they can't even hire uh, Ford actors because we get to replace with those. Yeah, you know, same thing, like... Ad revenue, don't leave my chat, bring. I need you. I gotta get comfy for my leg. Ah, uh, there we go. <laughs> it flew on Steve. <laughs> Appreciate it. You're welcome. To be fair, I think more toilets do plastic guns. This movie's got some weird transitions. Because he's like talking to a guy. But then it just goes over the water for reasons and then cuts back. Ha! <laughs> like, got armed guards at the toilet. You oh, grabbed that. That's a little frisky. We didn't lose. We stopped by higher ups in a battle we could win. So there's some repercussions from the last movie. It's kind of like a Superman, if you will. Huh? It's kind of taking the Superman route. Who's taking Superman route? This movie. Because he destroys the city fighting Zod, and then the next movie he has to, like, go in front of the court and kind of explain his things. Oh, your infection sucks. God, I want fried chicken and potato wings. For dinner, I had, I had uh, meatloaf and mac and cheese. It's pretty good. The only reason I had mac and cheese because I didn't have any instant mashed potatoes. Uh, I don't regret my decisions though. And I ate before this and I went for like a two hour bike ride. Now I'm eating popcorn. Why isn't he not blue? That's a toy. That's a toy. Oh, monsters are attacking the train, finally. What, what the is hell? That? Why does that look like uh, Biolante? It does look like Biolante. <laughs> okay, so the explosions look kind of like a volcano erupting. Also, hot dogs and hamburgers would also be acceptable. So they're hiding under their desk right now, currently. Wait, whoa, they reference all the giant monsters in this movie? Oh yeah, everything is toys, by the way. Okay, I was about to say, well, that's kind of cool this is in the same universe as Godzilla movies, I guess, but they're actually referencing uh, the movies, to be specific. I spilled popcorn all over me. 
That's what I've been worried about. Still trying to figure out why they got armor guards. What do you want from me? Aaron, you lied to me. You said you'd save me. I figured you'd probably try to cop peel under the desk. Kind of disappointing. That sucks, though. The greatest actors are not here. The anime chicks. I want a Coke. I do have a drink over here, though. Wherever it went. And you didn't bring me one, you ass. I didn't know you wanted one. Then Jessica got this for me. You're just funny. It's a slushy from the ice cream place because they're super cheap. Oh, well, sir, I think you're, disre you're disrespecting Gamer when referencing that. Even Super Monster Gamera so, Gamera so far has been better than this. Steve is, is a monster. TV? That is a tube TV. I thought it was a flat screen for a minute, but I'm like, I doubt they get for Those masks are cool. What? See, look. Oh. Those are 100% not military grade. But they're sweet. Oh, snap. Monster attacking. Oh, I think it's the movie alarm. It's the movie alarm. I thought it was my car for a minute. This is so, like, subtle. You're <laughs> such a Steve. Hey, look, it's the Americans! Gamera vs. God's Let me see. Why does it look like the Blues Brothers? I like how one's, like, fat. <laughs> They're both actually fat. I, just, uh, I, I think you, uh, you reevaluate your life situations. Yeah, well, it's like also like Pacific Rim Uprising, where they have some of the Gamera monsters on the computers. No hamburgers for you, Nina. Oh, snaps! Ragas appear. <laughs> He's wearing the skull mask. That's great. Looks like a mega death cover. Thick thighs. Okay, well, this is a mega death save lives. After watching this. She says Godzilla's thick. I said thick thighs save lives. That is true. No, let's look at the anime. The anime is doing really good. Still waiting for the toy to come out. But this time it's super huge. It's not just huge. Yep, I watched Loki. So currently they think that the monster uh, that attacked the train is the same monster as Raigo that just appeared. Ah. My legs hurt from the bike ride. So the skeleton fish are still uh, a thing. Thick thighs save lives. It's that simple. Gotta come up with a strategy. So I'm super excited that my uh, big bad package came in. What is it? Well, we got the the con, which I forgot to bring. Oh, so we should actually do this legitly, and take uh, the Kong and you know drop him for two feet, see what the damage is, four feet, see what the damage is, and then once he officially breaks, we'll just smash him and then burn him. Uh, no, we're, it's going to be a special video because I spent money to actually do this. We're getting M80s. <laughs> well, you let me know when you find those. <laughs> or you something. Something. He needs to go boom. SH Monster Arts Kong. Oh, the Ultima? Yeah. We got an extra one. We had to do. We have to do a special versus Hammer versus... the fuck? Why is the American question. using, like, the toy phone? Why not? I also want that skeleton phone. Hey, listen. I'm from the CIA. Let me talk to your commander. 
<laughs> English. Yeah, I know it will, but you know, I'll just let Steve have at it. Gotta do something fun with it. Something a little different, you know? Hey, go Judo 75, how's it going? That's pretty much what I want, though. Call needs to be a grenade. At least some firecrackers or something. Oh, can we do that? Can we get one of those, like, uh... The sparklers, but just put him on top of it? You want to melt them? I think it'd be funny, because you have everything spraying, and then you just... Thinking of ideas. Oh, I'm glad you're out of work. Work sucks. Mmm. I cream. want some ice cream. <laughs> oh my god, look at that toy helicopter. <laughs> I like that they couldn't even afford to make it proper color so that we have a pink toy helicopter. We kind of kind of invest the time in it to make it actually kind of look like a legit hel helicopter. Later, Doctor. Who the heck? So I'm pretty sure the majority of this movie takes place inside of somebody's house. It probably is one of the Barbie ones, to be fair. And he's just kind of standing there. Menacingly. God, that took a while to introduce that. I do kind of want the Raga toy that was hanging on the shelf, though. Oh, uh, yeah, that's a figure arts. He just went up for pre-order that day. Wait, 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 I did the filming for that. We, uh... I forgot about it, so that's why we kind of tossed it in the back part. Steve, can I donate $20 to ourselves so we can shut this off? So you want to pay me $20 so that you don't have to watch this anymore? Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> For love of God, yes! Make it 30 <laughs> Got yourself a deal. I think movie cost... Well, yeah, movie cost me 10 bucks, so that's double. That's $10 profit. Oh, kind of like a tour? I don't even know why he doesn't like this movie so much. He hasn't even finished watching it. I haven't even seen this all the way through. Because it's filmed in somebody's basement. 90% of the movie. Yeah, it's probably like a first floor. There were stairs. Yeah, he was going down. So that means he must have walked in and walked in somebody's basement. And turned this town to a construction site. Oh my god, they would have to pay me $10 to buy this movie. Hey, there's Ultra 7 sitting on the table. You know, there's been a lot of talking and some monsters kind of showing up. I'm kind of fearful that we're not going to really see any fighting. Oh my I will god. Say so far, the most exciting thing about this movie that I've seen is the intro trailers for this. I had a movie called Gi The Attack of the Giant Teacher. I kind of want to see what it's about. Because it's actually a dude fighting monsters. <laughs> I swear to god, I'm about to add, put $30 in there just to shut this crap off. What? Jesus Why Christ. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. But wasn't Ragnar just a, 
in the town? Why is he fighting battleships now? I can't take this. We're only, what, 20 minutes into this shit, maybe? I can't lose this time. Yeah, this movie, he kind of has a Godzilla sound to him, doesn't he? It is Godzilla sound effect. It kind of sounds like the Godzilla sound effect, but they, like, took the decibels and yeah. dropped them. The fuck is this? <laughs> well, we got some bubbling water and fire. So we got fire overlaying the water at. That's a weird angle. You ever watch this? It just kind of looks like somebody was making a YouTube video and just added all the special effects filters that they could. Somebody would have made this better on a YouTube than this sh trash. Oh, great to see you again. You know, I just got okay, my... Okay, so they have been they don't know they've been attacked by two kaijus. I just got my $200 gift card from at and Might be worth giving $30 to shut this off. Give me that at and gift card. I'll, <laughs> <laughs> I'll shut this off right now. I'll be like, thank you guys for watching. Now it's all around here. Love you, too. Oh my god, I wish they did. It would have been oh, better than this. He's apologizing for the tech with right. But he didn't cause any damage, though. He did, right there. He missed. He missed and he hit that, that, that Tokyo Tower, or whatever it is behind him, remember? Oh, the one, but yeah, but like, he's still. Oh, to be fair, in the second, well, that previous movie, when Ragu was going through the city, they couldn't afford him to break the buildings, anyways. So, I guess that kind of makes sense. But you have to watch it with us. If you guys gotta suffer, we gotta suffer together. I'm about to hammer this damn movie and give Steve ten dollars. Don't apologize for that. You ever see those little Godzilla movies where the missiles are literally just exploding everywhere? Oh my god, there's fireworks sparklers coming out of his mouth. I like that Raigo's doing the... He's doing the robot. There's sparklers coming out. See, that's what we gotta do. Oh, coming towards... Oh, okay. He does a sheen. He just came out of the water and was just like... Oh, look, the helicopter's green now. He's just... Oh, there's the monster. For some other reason, has fireworks coming out of his back. Right, I'm gonna be honest. Like, if I saw, so far, if I would have saw this, like, say, as like the like entry video, like one of those entry videos for like the film contest, or, like G Fest or something, yeah. I think this would be acceptable. No, no, it wouldn't, because they would do a better job than this. That's true. I've actually seen some better ones go through that than this so far. Like, there's one guy that does, like, claymation with it. Like, stop motion. It's so good. Oh, alright. The suit's coming out. It's a little fl fuzzy, but I'll I'll take it. Oh, his eyes lit up. Oh, <laughs> my. No way. <laughs> it's just, the monster's just there. <laughs> it is lit. What are these effects? It is literally a toy. No. Okay, I, to be honest, I still have to hate Dragon Wars more. Mainly because, like, I kind of know what I was getting into with this. I feel like Dragon Wars tricked me. Because <laughs> Dragon Wars is just a higher budget version of this. <laughs> Which is almost more offensive. Uh, hoping to work on it soon with the Stevie Toy Rips. I've had a lot of commissions, which have been taking a lot of my spare time. If I get to a point where those guys are down a bit more, I'll be popping into more Stevie Toy Rips. You doing okay over there? 
I was like, this isn't so bad. I don't get why they have so many effects filters, though. The only thing I can think of is, is like, to try to hide some of the, like, the suit and stuff. But to be honest, like, if they would just had the, the stuff flying, I think it would have worked better. To be fair. Because, like, you'd be able to see the suit a little bit better. I paid my money. Get the fuck out of my house with this shit. <laughs> get the hell out. <laughs> well, sir, we still have an no, hour. Uh, no, oh, no, uh, no, no, hold on. no. Yeah. <laughs> you get half that money back. It doesn't count. <laughs> no. Get the hell out of my house with this. How's the guys going? We'll have a Q&A for next 10 minutes. We're done with this. I paid my money. <laughs> you did it all out. My God, what was that shit? I made twenty-eight minutes. You can't be that man. <laughs> all right, guys. Oh. We'll watch this movie for another ten minutes and give you guys Q and A for ten minutes. Oh, I called her a gorilla lady. We got 50, we've jumped ahead. How did that happen? <laughs> Good one, Jaden. Oh, sweet. They're, maybe they're giants now. They're getting attacked by the toys, too. Alright guys, you got next uh, 10 minutes for Q&A, so shoot, what do you guys want to know? Alright, since we're uh, not really paying attention anymore, I want to see where the monsters are fighting. I just saw boobs. Whoa, whoa, we're turning, I want to see boobs. No, nope, we're too far now. No! I don't watch it anymore. I am interested now! <laughs> no top house for you. Aww. Alright. Wait, whoa, is there aliens now? God, these effects. Man, kaijus are tough. Oh, uh, those are not, those were uh, missiles, but they look. Wait, there's like an octopus? What is this octopus we speak of? Alright, fast forwarding a little bit. So. So there's, there's still no monster there's battle. There's still some explosions. Some kind of robot. Yeah, what is this octopus thing? I can't even see how. Oh, oh my is god. Good is now. Oh god, the robot talks. See you later, Gojira75. Thanks for stopping by. It's a robot monster. It's like a robot tentacles thing. Okay, well, so... Is that fighting him? I can't tell. The monster's just kind of rotating his head. Oh, oh, we got both of them on the same screen. They're powering up. Oh, my. F oh, he. Fucking God, what is this? This is so bad. How do you go from bad to good, okay, to worse? Slight enjoyment on huh? this, just for how oh, absurdly bad this is. Don't you lie to me, Matt. Why is it fire and spark? I don't get these filters. I paid money for you, shut this off. Shut it off. 
<laughs> I want to see the monster fight, damn it. What the hell does that guy do? It's, it's, it's like the camera attacked people? The city blew up. Why was no, there a camera? <laughs> Okay, I'm not done. <laughs> <laughs> oh Sorry, my guys. God. I guess we're not making it through all that. So, for our honest review, um, if you really hate yourself, buy this and watch it. Yeah. No. I do appreciate that Matt Frank uh, did some art, like stuff for it. That looked cool. I have a wife, thank you. Which means yes, I'm a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> I think for a small budget, to be honest, they probably would have been better off spending less time using the effects filters. Yeah. I think it honestly takes a... It's super distracting from what everything else is going on. The What's really bad is the effect filters. Like, they are just completely cut out everything else and just put cheesy, shitty... Oh, no. <laughs> put it on blue. <laughs> Oh, to I be so fair, sorry, if man. I would have saw the Blu-ray, I would have bought it too. <laughs> but we I can only find it in town on DVD. Um God, what happened? Because like the last one I was like, this isn't good, but like there there's fun to be had watching this. Alright, right? so first one was like PlayStation 2 CGI graphics. The first one right? was bad. First one was bad. But then number two was like, okay, their budget went up a little bit. Movies presentable. Not bad. It's doable. But the thing I like about the second one is, like, the first one, it takes itself seriously. Yeah. But then looks like hot garbage most of the time. So, can't really get into it. Second one doesn't really take itself seriously, and for what what it is, I think the effects were acceptable. I think it it's fine. the humans that made it, like, uh, watchable. Like, the characters, you know? You know what I mean? Yeah, well, then, even the second one, you like, when the monster's doing things, you at least can kind of tell what's going on, right? This one, I have no idea what that final fight thing was. It was just lights and things and monsters kind of standing there. So, um, if you really have seen every other monster movie and you feel like you need to check this out, sure. I think, I'm trying to, f like, find positives. See, the thing is, though, like, if I'm watching a 1950s monster movie like The Giant Claw, I'm expecting bad and I'm going to enjoy the bad. Well, it's, the, it's bad because of the time. Yeah. It's not really... Well, that's what I mean. Like, that's what I mean by... I'm, I was expecting this. This was made, like... 2019. What? 2019. So, I'm expecting a little bit. And I'm getting nothing. Like I said, even we're, like, going to the fact that, like, we're using toys and stuff. Like, just use the toys and just kind of bring it to, like, old school and just use some of the special effects. Like, I get that, like, the... the the filters are uh, definitely a lot cheaper than like buying actual, like the yeah. missile effect, like the the stuff to make the actual like practical effects. But even that, like they could have toned it down quite a bit, or even just dropped the runtime of the movie. Because to be honest, a lot of this kind of seems unnecessary for what we were seeing. Yeah, first thirty minutes was just taped in somebody's basement. That's what it looked like. Hey, hey. Yeah, man. Super nerds. That's okay. I, Me and my wife will definitely probably sit here and watch this because I know she's going to make me watch it. And no. thank God I got a phone that I can look at things. No. <laughs> and go with it. You know, now I'm interested in what the budget is. What's the limit? I don't, it. like, it's definitely, you can definitely tell it doesn't have a budget. Which makes sense. That's kind of, again, what I was going for when I was watching. Like, figure it first. But I think it would have been more charming if they just would have just relied more on the fact that it was a low budget than trying to add all this crap into there to try to make it seem like more things was going on than what it is. Because to be honest, it's pretty much like dude in a suit fighting a stationary object <laughs> in a way. Oh, way to lower the rug. It makes sense. 
But yeah, then you essentially just need, like, a monster fighting another monster. Like, why do we need to spend money on all this other random stuff? An undisclosed amount was the budget. What does that mean? Yeah, absolutely, toys. Undisclosed amount was the budget. Oh, they just haven't made it public. Probably. Yeah, I wonder why. Yeah, some of the characters don't seem too bad. Like, it's... You could get... You could kind of see what they were going for with the characters not really be Like, again, not really taking it super seriously, which is kind of what you gotta do with a lot of these lower-budget movies. Okay, the question is, for love of God, how does this movie have 4.6 out of 10? Good question. As a phone stand, what better use for a Kenner Arnold <laughs> than you being a phone stand? <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> My credit card max out at 8 grand, let's do this. Aaron, you were supposed to save me, you son of a... You didn't. You didn't. You failed us for the last time, Aaron. I would rather be trying to get raped in that Destiny's Raid than watch this. So you can't use that word to it offends people? You would rather get violated in your butthole. <laughs> <laughs> Execute Order 66. I'd give it a... I'd give it in the more of the three... Like, three realm. Because, again, I think... Like, five for me be mediocre. This definitely... Uh, there's a lot they could have maybe done with this to make it a little better for me. Because, again, like, I've, I've enjoyed watching, like, people's, like, homemade monster movies, right? It was better than this. And those people that have to have a lot less budget than this, Yeah. This movie's so... Oh, my God. Forcibly taken. <laughs> For anyone. <laughs> Should have just... Oh, keep... the alligator stabbing turtle? Um, I have to sit there and do the rest of the little... Th um, actually, like, showcasing them. And then I'll... Uh, you'll probably get a video. It probably won't be until probably sometime next... During the end of the week. Although, to be fair, it's probably will be in the next sort of how-to. Because it'll be an easy one for me to put up. What? That turtle I painted. Oh. The one that almost looked like a real turtle? Yeah, I was trying to get it like if we put, like, it actually has, like, moss effects on the back and stuff. Well, solid is bad. 100%. All, all joking aside. We joke. Just a lot of jokes. Steve. Yeah, because there's definitely a lot of, like, super low budget stuff I've, I definitely enjoy. Oh, my God. Like, heck, we've, um, one we should watch. Back in the days with sci-fi channel movies, you know. Is that, uh, that Jason David Frank movie that we bought a while back? It's like, something like The Warrior, The Dragon Warrior, something like that. Where it's literally just him in the woods fighting people. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. I'm just trying to think of a name of it. Not a real turtle. It was a, uh, uh, it was a turtle. Uh, one of the commissions I did got the, the guy got it on Amazon, and we're doing a turtle monster. And then he also got an extra turtle, and I just painted the turtle, straight up. Should have joined us for this review, Aaron. It was great. Yeah, and even like just a lot of those like were super old fashioned B movies. Like I think you could kind of take a lot of. Uh, Homages from that. I watched this one rated B movie on the Sci Fi channel, and it was like they literally took a spider toy on a string and it was attacking a girl while she was laying in a bed, you know, and was eating her, and that was better than this. <laughs> Rawr. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it was just like that. You know, we should watch yeah, that. Yeah, like King Kong Lives. That movie's horrible, but we should probably watch it. We should watch those movies. You know, I've never seen those older Kong movies. Except, your, like, the Claymation. And then... Yeah, uh, to be honest, I've never been a fan of the... Like, the... The Middle American ones. Yeah, I've never seen like those King middle Kong American. Lives. And... I've never seen those. Hey, hey. Don't make fun. 
Back actually, in, the Bad Shark movies are actually kind of fun, to be fair. Back in those days, that movie was the uh, scary, okay? There's a few of those Asylum ones. Like, there was the... Uh, oh. Like, the ones that was in the trailer for the previous one, they actually look kind of funny. Well, the guys are in the house, and the like the, the sharks, like, it's like a land shark just going after people. Oh, oh no, no. That, that preview that we saw the other day, where the shark comes out of the toilet. Yeah, like We that. gotta watch that. <laughs> yeah, then there's, like, the shark movie movies, stuff like that. Those are, like, they're actually kind of fun. Yeah, it was, well, like, the, something kind of happens. With the last movie, Raiga 2, I think it was, and we were watching it, and there was a shark... Literally comes out of a toilet and bites a girl in her butt. Yeah, Son of Khan's good. Like, the Son of Khan, Mighty Joe Young, I, I feel kind of are all in the same vein for me. Yes, Shark came out of a toilet and bit the girl in her butt while she was on a toilet. It looked amazing. Who doesn't want a legendary Gabra? <clears throat> yeah, a legendary Gabra would be nice. That's what Khan could fight next. We still, like, Khan could stuff. We still 100% have the rights for him. Khan versus Gabra. Just change his name. Yeah, so like some of Kong's is actually pretty decent. You know, I, like that one you good. know, I seen it at Walmart, Steve, at that dump bin for three seventy five. All those Kong movies. I had them. Do you? I have the I have the King Kong lives and stuff too. I just I had it's one of those like I have them for the sake of having them. I also have like a giant box set of gorilla monster like gorilla like horror monster movies that my mom got me. But I guess we'll probably call it good here. Unreal. I can't. No, man. This my my thought on this movie is just oh. I think this movie would definitely. It's kind of in the same vein as the other one, but the other one I feel like you can watch with a couple people and have fun watching. This you kind of need a purpose to watch this. Like you guys decided, like, hey, we're gonna get, we're gonna get some. <laughs> Chips. We're gonna get a bunch of people over. We're gonna have shots. And we're gonna watch Rakan Raga versus. I would The thing is, I wouldn't even have an issue with this movie if it was just like a bad CGI, you know, toys, whatever. But it's those filters. The fi the filters are the things distracting me the most from this. Because a lot of it, like, it doesn't even make sense. Oh, I forgot just to be honest. Be honest, like, King Kong escapes is fine. Outside of, like, the con suit's questionable, but the movie's fine. Background noises. Oh, yeah, you still got your AC on. Yeah, I do, don't I? I just forgot about that. Yeah, it's gotta be something every live stream, you know? <laughs> it just occurred to me, I was just like... Well, we're going to be ending this year in a minute anyways. It doesn't even matter at this point. Yeah, doesn't matter. But, all right. <laughs> I, think, I think we've had our fun here. Uh, look forward to you guys on the chat tomorrow. Uh, review up will be, a, re, a review will be up for the YMSF uh, unpainted Son of Godzilla figure. Uh, also as a skit. So, uh, look forward to that. And then I gotta sit here and bug Arnez about doing more gaming videos. So we got two videos a day. Did you bring me that in, uh, intro for the Kill a Kill? I brought you two of them. Which one is the other one? Yeah, they're both kind of the same. They have different beginnings. Oh. So I got you a week. No, story. I paid $25, Aaron, for him to shut it off. I feel like I got ripped off because he's gonna get half of it back, so he only really paid $12. Plus, they're gonna take money <laughs> out of it, so I didn't get my $20 to shut this off. <laughs> So he jipped me. It was worth it. One hundred percent jipped. It was worth it. You you gotta just rewind it, find it up part where it just like it show like this part where it was like toys fighting, and then it just put this horrible filter where like it was spinning. So like the missile, like, so like the missile hit the spinning part, and the missile was just like spinning. And I was like, no, 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 get out. Yeah, the only thing about the uh, the. Um our sponsors, they can't be in every video. Uh, you, you guys will only really see it, like, once a week-ish. <laughs> there you go, Steve. Alright, I feel a little better now. <laughs> Wait, but I gotta split that with Arnez, so you have to double it. <laughs> <laughs>
Because I'll only see four of them. God, I wish it was Pizza Hut. Now I'm kind of craving pizza. Oh, yeah. pizza. Why are we always we talking about the food? One. Yeah, we always get the food out here because I like food. Have you seen this? Food is great. I went to my mom's house to do weed whacking. For some odd reason, every time I go over, she tries to shove food down my face, which is fine. But I don't understand my mom's cooking method because she was making breakfast burritos, but she had, tor- like, tacos. It's the only thing she really had, so she was making burritos out of the tacos. <laughs> Welcome to the fat club. <laughs> and then she was doing hash browns with potatoes and cheese put in there. And then she was literally made entirely one of those giant packages of bacon that she got from the Amish market. Made the entire stupid thing. And was just putting the entire giant strips into the top. Like, they were overflowing like a BLT. So fat. So I ate one of those, and then I literally proceeded to eat probably about, like, eight strips of bacon while talking to her, and then I went and re-biked. You know I'm doing bacon for breakfast tomorrow. You want to stop by, Steve? Maybe. I'm, I'm not. She gave me a package, so I'll probably be doing bacon Tuesday morning because Jessica does it. So I'll probably make breakfast that day. No, no, the best. Probably gotta do laundry. The best thing to do is when she's not home, and then you just then get all the bacon. Yeah, then you just leave all like the rest, like the mess, so she can see what you did, so she knows what she missed out on. <laughs> That's what makes oh, it great. Oh God, because that goes well for me. Jeez, I told her I was going to watch this movie. She got mad. Be like, we haven't even watched it. Like, I'm doing you a favor. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. No, we can just eat bacon on this channel. Just eat bacon and watch movies. Yeah. <laughs> I got an air fryer down there. We'll have Rochelle. She'll just air fry a plate in the time uh, and bring it up yes, here. Yes, it was thick cut bacon. Personally, I like regular bacon because I like my bacon almost burnt. Like, when I bite into a bacon, I almost want that thing to disintegrate into my mouth. I want it no. crispy and fall like a bacon. We'll just buy, like, ten packages of bacon... We'll find like a three-hour-long movie. We'll we'll do a marathon of the uh, the Hobbit and the Lord of the Rings. Oh, can, can we just skip the Hobbit? And we'll just <laughs> eat bacon the whole time. Okay, I will say I enjoyed this more than I liked the second Hobbit movie, though. Okay, <laughs> you know this is better than any of the Hobbits actually. Oh, uh, sir, the first one is perfectly fine. The second one royally upset me. And then the third one also really upset me because I'm like, this movie was unnecessary. Like, half this, like, the beginning 15 minutes of this movie should have been in the previous one to make it make sense and have a conclusion leading into this movie. But now we gotta do stupid things. Hate life. <laughs> we talk about pulling <laughs> guys on bacon. Yeah. That's how fat <laughs> boys work, you know? And then the, my mom, St. Bernard, was just looking at me the entire time, just like, hey, hey, I'm your friend. Give me some. And I proceeded to give him none because, again, I'm fat. I'm okay with the whole eating bacon while we, uh, we can just review bacon while we watch movies. My problem is, is, like, I've been spoiled now where I can only get bacon from, like, the legit meat market that we have. Or going to the Amish. <laughs> well, that's why buying we, it from them. That's why we gotta start just buying all the bacon from the stores around here and see which one's the best. Got this. The Baconator channel. I will say, honestly, though, like, from around here... How much grease can we collect in our beards today? <laughs> I actually almost prefer, like, a... Not promoting it, but, like, Walmart has, like, a low-sodium bacon. It's honestly really good. Like, I actually like yeah. it better than the regular bacon, because it's not really, like... It didn't taste less salty, but I guess it is. Yeah, some of that stuff can be salty. <laughs> like, it was just, like, the right amounts. Kind of, like, getting it from, like, the Amish market and stuff. Bootlegs are cheaper. I like my bootleg Woody better than regular Woody. It's rare. Um, for a lot of bootlegs, generally it's Transformers. You actually sometimes get you make out better buying a bootleg, especially yeah. like masterpieces and stuff like that. Godzilla, not so much. Like I've never really gotten a bootleg Godzilla item that's been close to being as good as the regular one. What about the uh, what's the one that I bought you? Uh, Eighty five, I think was it. Yeah, like he was. I would say good but i like it it was okay like it looked fine the paint job that the whoever at that factory did uh, 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 yeah ah, let's cut it here not for this nonsense but now i really need to make custom bacon godzilla what would i use as a ba- like what would it, it would just be godzilla's legs and just have bacon strips 
Ah. <laughs> uh, hey, Jolly. You just missed it. We talked about food, bacon, pizza, Godzilla. We made it partway through the movie, so sorry about doing a full commentary. <laughs> we made 27 minutes into the movie before I, I said no more. Good this was. Yeah, that is true. There, and there isn't too many buying store bought stuff that I've liked, especially from Walmart. Ugh. Like, I'm trying to think of what else is really like. Have I ever bought the value stuff there? Like, where we live. No! <laughs> like, Kroger's value stuff's actually pretty solid. But. Stop damaging my case, you already cracked the quarter! You know what? No, no, this one's expensive! No! <laughs> Not the blue one. Show me what's it. Uh. Steve, we need to see a Baconzilla versus. Pain Kong? Pancake Kong. Pancake, you know, get it. No, what I do is you get those, um, oh, uh, those sausages wrapped in pancakes. They're like corn dogs, but it's pancake instead of the... And that'll be the beam. No, that'll be the body, and then you make the pancake limbs. Well, anyways, help us feed those kaijus by hitting that like button. Subscribe to Come Ranger today. We also got Instagram, Patreon, Pinterest, and Facebook. Guys like to keep up with the date with Trailer Donut. We greatly appreciate it. We'll see you guys in the next video. Peace oh. out. I'll let you uh, have fun trying to get up with our jerry rig bike to turn it off. Need my powers. Damn, I missed. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> I got this. I got this. I'll solve this problem for you right now. Have a good one, everybody.